guys welcome back to my channel so I did a thing <laughs> Okay, so let's talk about this cleanse. So it all started when I was watching a podcast and someone mentioned that they did a long fast of cleanses. It was like, I think like 30 to 60 days. So my whole mindset was, I can do this now. I didn't jump to the 30 and 60 days, but I knew that I can do it a few consecutive days in a row to start out with. So the way my mind worked, it picked a number seven and said, I'm going to do a seven day a juice cleanse. And so I stuck it out. In the later part of this video, I have my prep process for the seven days and then I also just basically vlogged every day to just show you kind of what was going on, how I felt, and what I was noticing from the cleanse. The first reason I went to do this cleanse was because one, over the past couple of years, I just have gotten off of how I should be eating. I have not been eating the cleanest and I have been going for the more indulgent food items and i really do value my health i really do value you know that space i just allow life to kind of take over and i just stopped putting as much healthier things in my body that i should have been doing so that was one reason why i wanted to do this juice cleanse and then also i noticed that i was not losing weight and that my body had like hit this plateau so i've been in the same range weight wise for a while so one of the things i was hoping from this was that i would kind of like not trick my body but make my body be like okay she switched things up she's doing things differently so let's drop this weight i don't know how long it's been but it's been quite a while that i've been stuck in a specific weight range and i tried so many things to try to break it and get out of it all types of workouts i tried eating less and just i was staying in this range and finally i lost six pounds I did check again today, this morning, once everything was over, just to make sure that my weight didn't go back up because I'm used to, from the past times that I checked my weight, losing like three pounds, and then I check again a couple of days later, and it's back to where the number was. So this time, the number did not go back after I finish the seven day cleanse and I feel like everything that I was trying to do in this worked. So the next reason why I did this cleanse was because I wanted my body to just crave more of those healthier things again. I feel that my cravings and desires for healthier foods and healthy foods was like, it wasn't that strong anymore and obviously because that hasn't been the main thing that I have been eating and so I was hoping from doing this juice cleanse that it would help me to pick back up wanting and craving those healthier things. I do believe that that mission has been accomplished. And some other things that I noticed while doing this cleanse was that I felt so good. I had so much clarity than I've had lately and I just felt lighter. I noticed that my I was going really well. It's just the last two days I noticed that I wasn't going so I wasn't really sure if it was because there really wasn't much in my system to really flesh out aside from the healthy things that I was putting in my body or was my body like uh <laughs> we need some more stuff to cleanse out but since then I've been going fine and no problem I do feel more like an urgency not because of a bad thing but I just feel more like 
inclined to eat healthier things now and then finally i felt like my body was able to detox efficiently so during this cleanse i allowed myself to drink natural juices i juiced three types of juices and i have included how i made them in this video a little later i bought fruit smoothies that were already pre-made i had juice shots and then i also whenever i just was like i need another type of smoothie i just went to go buy my smoothies i allowed myself to eat salads i allowed myself to drink tea with natural sweetener which i opted for honey because that's normally what i will use when i drink my tea and then i also allowed which i really didn't drink much i think i drank two throughout the whole seven days a probiotic kind of like you know the probiotic sodas that are popular now and then i allowed myself to have nuts but i don't normally eat nuts like that so i did have boiled peanuts because <laughs> when i did eat those i just felt like i was almost just like over it all and i just needed some salt so those were the nuts that I ate. I know it's not the most natural form of a nut, but don't judge me. I ate them and I felt fine. Those are the things that I allowed myself to eat on this cleanse. I am glad that I did do this cleanse. And then lastly, before I jump into the next part of this video, I just hope that if you're watching this, you are inspired to go to that next level in your lifestyle health journey and i'm not saying that this seven day juice cleanse is what everybody should do but i'm just sharing my experience so that you can see how it worked for me i will of course always say if you feel like you want to try something new that can affect your health be sure to check with a nutritionist or your doctor and do what works for you don't necessarily feel like you have to tailor your process or what you want to do based off of somebody else's like for me I knew for sure 30 days was not going to work for me. I knew, for, well, at least not right now. And I knew for sure 60 days for me, that would have been torture. So even at 30 days. <laughs> Let's go ahead and get into how I prepped. Good morning guys, it's day one of this juice cleanse. I'm gonna try my best to make it these seven days. This is the first time I've ever done something this extreme, but the reason I want to do it is because I just feel like right now I need something to kind of like reset my body and just start fresh. And I feel like the discipline that I will gain from the seven day juice cleanse will help to just will help me all around in the other areas of my life so i have not actually drinking anything today i'm going to go fix my first juice <laughs> and the reason i'm laughing is because for me this is extreme i am an eater like i like eating food and i make sure i eat my three meals a day so this is going to be so different for me but i am determined to do this for the goals that i have 
I honestly don't know how I'm going to, you know, react over these seven days. I, in my mind, have thought maybe I'll be irritable because I'm so used to having food and, you know, not saying that I won't have any calories in my body, but hopefully that doesn't happen. And then also one thing that I have been doing like every single day for a while, for like months, back to back is drinking some form of coffee and that is not you know gonna be happening these next seven days if I you know <laughs> keep it together and do my seven day cleanse but you know I'm excited for the new change along with the fruit juices so I made my own juices as mentioned earlier and then i also bought some pre-made juices like what i'm about to drink now is like a pre-made juice smoothie so i'm gonna give that a try and hopefully that will hold me for a few hours and then i'm also allowing myself to drink natural tea and honey because honey is natural so i'm gonna give myself that and then i'm able to eat fruit because i mean I'm already juicing. I'm drinking, you know, juiced fruit and veggies. So the fruit that I have to eat in the fridge is some sliced up watermelon and then some sliced strawberry and pineapple. That's my favorite fruit. And I'm trying to think. I think that's a oh, water, but you know, that's a given. That's really all I'm allowing myself to really eat. I'm actually excited i'm hoping to see some results and yeah and let's go make this first smoothie and then i'm gonna start getting some work done and we can see you know how day one goes got the ice let's get this juice Okay, so I'm going to be drinking Boathouse Farms. This is amazing mango, says no sugar added, 13 fruit servings per bottle, 100% fruit juice smoothie. So I have not tried this brand before. I saw it when I was at Aldi and I feel like this is gonna be good to have in this week, okay. I feel like this might be one of the most tastiest <laughs> things about this cleanse the juices that i made on my own they're not bad but you know when you juice your own stuff it definitely don't be given you know extra good so not always about to drink my juice smoothie whatever you want to call it It's pretty good. Tastes very pureish, but I feel like this is gonna be like the most, as far as juice, the thing that keeps me filled the longest. Now this is just my theory, I don't know for sure, but we're gonna see, so I have stuff to do, so I'll see y'all in a few hours. Okay, so it's about two hours later. I am feeling a little hungry. So I'm about to make me some green tea with lemon and honey. One thing that I have already noticed is that when I went to go, you know, cleanse and relieve myself, I didn't have any problems. I went well, that we're gonna just leave it at that. So that was just me drinking one <laughs> fruit juice. So I'm excited to see what's gonna happen with the rest of this uh process emotionally i feel fine i have been thinking like how am i gonna get through this a couple of times but staying busy has helped so it's about the end goal i don't know why i jumped to seven days why i didn't just start with three or you know but maybe the seven days is what is needed so <laughs> we're gonna see but anyway you can watch me make the tea Okay, so I'm just waiting for the water to finish boiling. I already put my lemon juice in here. And I'll throw this tea bag in here.
Okay, y'all, so I am back <laughs> at home. I've been home for a little while. I have not finished all of my tea, but I drank most of it. And literally all I had today was the first juice and tea. So it is kind of normal in my patterns when I'm working are like just busy. I don't always stop and eat. For the most part, I eat all my, you know, I don't really miss meals, but I will like push it back are up depending on if I'm busy so I still eat three meals a day which honestly I don't even know if we really have to do that it's just been habit you know since I've been eating basically <laughs> so here's my plan because I am used to eating at least about 15 1600 calories every single day and I feel like I probably have that I don't even know if I have 500 calories today. And considering that, I actually feel pretty good. I feel energetic. I feel like my system is being cleansed. So I'm gonna go ahead and get the salad tonight. I'm gonna order a large. So I'm not going to get on the salad any meat. I am gonna keep the cheese on there just for like, just a little, little something. And then I'm gonna eat Italian dressing. And for dinner, that'll just be my dinner. Honestly, I feel like that's not a big deal in this cleanse because of the fact that I am somebody who has not been eating a super mega amount of veggies and fruits over the past couple of years outside of juicing. I'll eat it here and there. And I feel like this is gonna be major for my body. This is gonna be really good for my body. I do believe I can make the seven days I do believe it. I do believe I'm going to. I'm just gonna just incorporate the salad for dinner. And I'm trying to decide if I'm gonna eat a little bit or I don't wanna overdo it. I just want something in my body and I'm trying to stay as close to completely natural. The fact that I have not had coffee today and I'm not having like jitters or withdrawals or anything like that says a lot because the way i've been drinking coffee has been like every single day non-stop so that is a good sign maybe my body honestly is just like girl let's just take a break anyway that's basically update for right now i'm gonna get this salad and i'll just show you what i eat tonight okay y'all so i'm just putting in this quick update i'm gonna go ahead and drink one of the homemade juices that I made on Saturday. And this will be, uh, I think, all the juices that I'm gonna have today. So along with the salad, I think I'm gonna drink some detox tea and honey. So here goes the second juice of the day. I might have to up it to three every single day. I kind of was preparing to have three a day. This is the salad. I'm gonna eat half of this tonight. And then the other half for dinner tomorrow night. And I'm going to have some detox tea tonight. So this will be the completion of day one. I will check in tomorrow. Hello, guys. <laughs> so it is day two. I don't even know what to say. So it is about five o'clock in the afternoon. I have not eaten anything. The only thing I have drinking, drink, the only thing I have drinking, drink. <laughs> this point right now, I don't even care. You get what I'm trying to say, is water. And that is because when I got up, you know I had a lot of things planned, things that I need to do. And you know, I'm like, let me go outside and water the grass. And all of a sudden, the little spout, it just broke. So water just pouring out of it. It couldn't be fixed manually, so had to figure out how to get the water cut off. <sighs> Thank God that I already juiced everything, so I don't need to cook. <laughs> and um, everything, basically, that I want to eat, I have. I have water bottles, so for when I want to drink tea, I can just heat it up in a thing. But... It's been hours of what feels like labor, okay? You probably can see all the sweat on my face. But right now, I'm about to have my first thing that's actual nutrient dense. Well, water is nutrient dense, I believe. We need water to live. But you know what I'm trying to say, like food-wise, well, fruit <laughs> and veggie-wise, um, which is real food, so. We're just gonna keep moving on. 
I'm gonna have my first juice of today. I honestly feel really good today. Like when I got up, I felt so good. As far as like energy and everything, I felt really great. I did not feel weighed down. And even though it would be nice to have a slice of pizza, a burger, you know, all those things, I am still motivated to continue on. So it's day two and I still feel like I can get through it. I don't feel like I'm going through withdrawals. So maybe I just need it this time because my body seems to be responding well. Even after eating half of the salad, I still was like, the day one was like really hungry. But other than that, well not really hungry where I just felt like I couldn't get through. But I could tell that I for sure could have ate <laughs> quite a bit more and I would have been, um, and like if I was normally eating, I could have ate quite a bit more and I would have been fine. But I still felt good. Like I didn't feel like starved, starved. Today I feel just good without anything on my tummy. It feels good to be at this place to feel like if I just have something light, I'm good. It's close to almost nighttime, but I still have stuff to do, so I'm just gonna have to figure it out. You know, when stuff starts to act up, you know, you still gotta just keep going, okay? Okay y'all, so I'm about to have, finally, it's been another hour <laughs> since I just checked in, but, and I still have not had anything in my body besides water i'm out to make my first at 5 20 in the afternoon which i don't plan on making this a habit my first juice and then i'm gonna have some sea moss gel i'm just gonna eat it from the spoon so All right, y'all, cheers to healthy eating mm -hmm. and getting that summer body that you want, okay? And just health in general, okay? We care about good health. Guys, it's tea time. So, <laughs> this is the tea that I am going to be drinking. I drank this last night. I love this tea. The lady that I bought this tea from, I found her on TikTok and I've been drinking her teas for quite a while now and I really love it. Whenever I drink this one, I feel like it definitely does cleanse me out, but in a comfortable way, if you get what I'm saying. So I'm gonna drink one of these tea bags and that's gonna be my next thing for today. I'm going to add some honey in it, of course. I love honey. I try my best to stick to raw honey every time. And yeah. Hi guys, so it is day three of this cleanse. I am actually really shocked. One, I'm not as hungry as I thought it would be. Two, I feel great. I'm not actually shocked that I feel great because obviously when you're putting more natural things in your body, it's gonna help you to feel better because that's really what we should be putting in our bodies. I feel great as far as clarity, as far as energy, and I feel like I'm getting stuff done. So that's been really exciting. Let me tell y'all something. So. I last night had a dream that I was eating a pizza sub and I know that's the devil trying to get me to mess up because I one feel great like continuing like this and two uh-uh nothing to mess this up uh-uh I got it's day three I have four more days to go so I'm gonna continue on how I've been doing it where I I do my juices and teas so today I had two homemade juices and I had two cups of like mugfuls of green tea and honey and I just feel great I feel lightweight like I'm not filled with a bunch of junk food <laughs> and I'm excited to continue this journey on so tonight i'm gonna have to pick up another salad because i didn't already ate up the first two days of the salad so this salad is gonna last another two days the one that i pick up tonight and even though of course i've thought of maybe i should you know could try this food or this or that i really 
honestly don't feel as tempted as I thought I would. Like, I have not had coffee in three days. Wait, money. Yeah, three days. And I've been drinking it every single day for months back to back. And it was like a struggle, it felt like, for me to stop. It was so addicting. So, this feels great. I hope that the rest of the days feels this great. We're going to see how the rest of these days go. So I just wanted to check in for day three. I'm actually about to go to my dance class and I feel okay. Like I feel like I have the energy to go to my dance class. I thought about whenever I went to my other workout class because I do go to some other high intensity classes, which I have not been to them this week yet. I thought about doing water and my protein powder that is plant-based but honestly right now i don't feel like i even need anything other than the juices and the things that i've been eating for energy to work out so about to head out i will check in with you guys either tonight or tomorrow because i feel like not much will be different for this day but i can for sure say i do feel good hi guys it's day four <laughs> i am so such in a good mood you know i really am so i feel great i feel great i feel great i feel like my body is responding just great to this cleanse i love the idea now of just filling my body with more fruits and veggies not that i didn't before but i just wasn't as i was intentional but not like i'm gonna go get a salad instead of pizza i would just get the salad with pizza so i am hoping that my mindset will stay changed as far as staying and sticking to better options as I proceed for it. Now I'm not saying I'm not gonna enjoy myself anymore and have those indulgent meals at all, but I feel like a level of clarity. I feel good and I feel like this is where I want to be all the time, you know. <laughs> Just feeling good, not feeling weighed down, not feeling bloated and inflamed. And I have some check-in news. So I am telling you, I have weighed the same weight for a little while now. And I've worked out, I've done cardio, I've done weights. I have even tried to stick to a certain amount of calories. And what I have found is that at least the last six months to probably a year, my weight has just been like stuck in the same kind of range so this morning i weighed myself and i'm six pounds lighter and really almost seven that means a lot to me and that tells me a lot i have been going regularly so i know that my stomach my track gi track is being cleansed out and also i feel like this was the thing that was good for me to kind of like have my body be like okay she's doing something different so i do pray that the six pounds stay off and then the other pounds that i want to lose stay off but i felt like i just feel good i feel like that's a good sign and that is it was just what i needed to see to know that you're on the right track keep going you're gonna lose the weight just stay focused and yeah so feel good today I'm eating literally the same things I've already showed y'all. I am probably gonna eat some fruit in a little bit and then I am gonna sign up for exercise class today only because I know that I need to be more active. I have over the, I think past year or two, not been as active as I could have been. And so I don't want that to become a lifestyle habit. Even if I wasn't eating good, I made sure that I was working out and I just feel like that's a part of my lifestyle that I like is working out and not necessarily because I'm trying to be the skinniest ever. I just feel good and I do feel like working out does help me to maintain that physique that I like. So no more being lazy, okay? Gonna do that. And I was actually shocked because I thought that doing this cleanse would mean that I wouldn't be able to work out how I wanted to, but I feel so good. Even with working out yesterday, I still just feel so good. I don't feel like super hungry. 
but I am making sure that I am getting these juices in and my teas in. I love green tea. I had that again today. And then this salad and some fruit. And right now I'm drinking the mango smoothie. Good morning, y'all. It's day five. I am over, not over, over, but I'm like ready for this cleanse to end today. Literally, probably just gonna have some tea. I am gonna get a smoothie from Tropical Smoothie and a salad from Tropical Smoothie also. I feel like it's day five and I'm ready to go back to eating what I wanna eat, but I'm making it uh -huh. Saturday and Sunday. That's really what I am interested in seeing how I handle Saturday and Sunday because Definitely the weekends are my go out and eat and have fun with what I'm eating and you know I don't really have too much restraint on the weekend when it comes to food. So so yeah, I'm definitely interested to see how that's gonna go, especially when you have like temptation around you to eat whatever you want or you know like people around you that's eating also. So I might just actually stay by myself because <laughs> One of my favorite things to do is to actually socially eat. I don't even know if that's a thing, but I just like going out to eat with people and just, you know, enjoying the moment. So, <sighs> yeah, I'm also gonna get my smoothie and my salad and get some work done. But I will say that I do still feel lighter and cleanse so okay so this is my salad from tropical smoothie i got a side of corn because it came with this side i have my smoothie i feel like this will be the bulk of what i eat today this is the healthiest that i've eaten i feel like probably ever like in a consecutive time period probably ever <laughs> Okay, y'all, so I'm starting to be tempted. Today was actually kind of hard. So I needed some salt. I could feel like I just needed something salty. And to keep me from being, you know, distracted to go get something else, I ended up going to the store. So I have some bull peanuts. These are just in a can. And this is the only thing that I could think of that was kind of like, well, that grows from the ground that has some like, don't feel like I'm starving myself or anything. And then I also have my green tea in here. So this is what I'm about to eat and drink. I also got some vegetable broth, but I just needed something with salt in it. over this i'm over over this i only have four hours left so i technically am almost officially over this so i just got home i was not home for the past two days so i had to improvise and i ate the same thing basically two days in a row bowl peanuts i ate a salad every single day of those two days and then the smoothie and then I was sipping on green tea and I had peppermint tea so I didn't have much to really eat on in those two days but I still was able to stay within my goals of what I wanted to stay in it is the last day of this cleanse and I'm so grateful so thankful it has been a rough day I got up this morning craving coffee couldn't have it I actually today went to go get an iced coffee I didn't drink it I got it for in the morning when this is all over so I'll show you the reason it looks like this is because they didn't put ice in it, but I got a large and I was actually uh, a little shocked that it looked like this, but I haven't drunk it. It's just been jumping around in the car and me bringing it in the house all day. So, and sorry y'all, my camera died, but in the morning I'm putting some ice on my coffee and I am sipping it because 
that's one of my favorite coffees the only reason i got it was because i had to go to the side of town that has it and i was like i might as well you know just go ahead and get one for um in the morning i did go today to the store and I, look i'm celebrating this because seven days with no meat eating salads i had boiled peanuts and smoothies and juices the fact that i made it through this it was only god because honey these last couple of days <laughs> i was ready to just give it all up but the fact that i have made it through this ooh, 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 ooh. but yeah i got me a cupcake to celebrate the end of this at midnight i'm eating my cupcake and i'm gonna go to sleep because i need to get up early in the morning so i'm gonna actually check in at midnight and <laughs> i guess just you know give my final goodbyes for this video but i will say that things that i've noticed um definitely notice that my stomach looks smaller so that's a good thing no bloating really um i have noticed that even though i've been doing the cleanse i needed to pick up water intake because you know i'm detoxing and cleansing and i wasn't getting in enough water as i should so that's definitely something i noticed that i needed to pick up i noticed that the last couple of days i have not went to the bathroom in that way if you get what i'm trying to say i don't know if it's because i'm putting the nutrient dense food then my body like vegetables and fruits then my body is like let me keep this in here let me hold on to this but I do know that I normally um, at least once a day go, but I don't feel like stopped up or anything. So I don't know if my body is like, you're cleansed right now. Like, you're good. You don't need to go. That was just something I've noticed the last two days. And also the last two days, because I was so limited, it wasn't like I ate a lot or was able to even get a lot of extra juices in last day i have been doing a lot of running around because it's been keeping me busy and not focused on food i'll show you my dinner that i'm gonna have tonight this is the last thing for this cleanse and i may do another juice it just depends i had I, today i did two green juices i had a smoothie because i went to the mall so i just got a smoothie from the mall and this salad is gonna be the rest of you know this cleanse aside from wanting coffee although i didn't drink the coffee and that is big for me to have this thing sitting in my face <laughs> and it's still be in the cup says a lot the reason i didn't really eat much today other than the two juices and the smoothie is because honestly i feel like now that i've been doing this cleanse i really haven't had a huge feeling left like i just have to eat right now yes i thought about it and yes it felt nice like yeah it would feel nice to you know eat something right now but it wasn't like a like right now like i can't take this anymore and i i'm assuming that's because discipline has been improved in this clint so this is my salad y'all oddly enough i am not sick of salads but i do want a couple of days away from a salad okay depending on where it's from but this is gonna be my salad tonight i'm gonna check back in at midnight right before i eat my cupcake so y'all can see <laughs> that i made it through if i made it through i just have the faith to know that y'all can make it through too okay all right y'all so i am back to end this video it's 11 39 so i have 20 minutes pretty much to get ready so i can finally eat back to my normal i guess <laughs> way of choosing how i want to eat so right now i'm just preparing some air fryer wings some hot wings and then i had a frozen quesadilla that i'm about to cook in the oven just so i can have a snack because i'm really hungry but i'm about to check out now i'm basically done with this cleanse I am so grateful that I made it through this. I feel good. I honestly don't regret doing this. And I think now I want to incorporate doing this in maybe like a quarterly thing. I feel like that would be really good. But still incorporating the juices more into my everyday life. So, yeah.
that's it if you made it this far i thank you for watching if you are on your own journey or thinking about doing your own journey i hope the best for you and yeah if you have done this before are gonna do this let me know how your experience went but i'm checking out of this documentation of this <laughs> this cleanse and i hope you enjoyed bye